Hi, I'm Jason Webb from Your Horsemanship, and I've created a loading and traveling bundle. In this bundle, I've got seven videos varying from horses that are tricky to load or have developed habits or resistances to loading. When you load her, what does she do to sort of avoid the situation? So she'll just plant herself or she'll try and go up or she'll run you into the fence. Run you into the fence? That's yeah. her technique. How does she run so you into the fence? So what happens is you'll go to load her and if you are nicely going in, she will then turn that way, pull you around, see the fence, and push you straight into the fence like this. <laughs> oh really? That's quite a manoeuvre. Yeah. Loading and to horses that have never been loaded before. In this bundle, you'll see some great tips on how to overcome problems or just show a horse for the first time how to load and travel safely and confidently. One of the first things is where you position your box. Now I know you can't always do that at a show, but for training purposes, get your box in a direction so that your stables or where your horse would like to be is on the other side of your box. You're loading towards it. So I've got our stables that way, so I'm loading towards the stables. Now I have seen it all, having done loaders for the last 20 years, from horses that stop and will not move, horses that rear, horses that try and run off with you. And all these problems are down to specific training in, in how you manage that situation. So we look, or I look specifically at um, straightness. It's the first thing that horses start to do to people that uh, are having trouble loading. They start to go crooked and uh, start to look for a way out. So I look at how to get that straightness back so your horse is facing up the ramp and looking to go where you want them to go. Also putting a forward cue on your horse so I teach a horse that a tap with a, with a whip generates energy and they follow the direction that I offer with the head collar. Another key principle to getting your horse to go wherever you want them to go. Now, I will say with a lot of, a lot of horses that are bad loaders, I'm showing you a process, but it does come down to good ground manners. If you can't do these movements away from the, the box or the trailer, then you're really gonna struggle on the box. But for all this to work, it really relies around your timing and feel, which I can't emphasize enough. So it does take practice, but all the techniques you need to load your horse successfully, to get your horse to travel and settle on the box, and also to take your horse off the box safely. Sounds really easy and why can't everybody do this? However, it isn't always easy and it's such an important and fundamental um, part of owning horses, whether you need to take them to the vets for treatment or you just wanna take your horse out and have some fun, which is, let's face it, why we have horses. So have a look at this bundle because if you're having trouble with loading or traveling your horse, this could be a game changer for you. Have a look.